Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. I hope you've all had a lovely day so far. It's 11 o'clock and I'm still in my PJs. I'm not gonna lie, I haven't even got dressed yet. I have been really busy. Um, I've just been sorting out some shopping that I picked up yesterday and having a little bit of a pot around the house. Mum's phone, dad's phone, sister's phone, best friend's phone. Everybody wants a chat today. But what I wanna do is try out this new colour gloss up product that I picked up in Savers yesterday. So I picked this up from Savers yesterday, it was £5.99 and I did check, it's pretty much £5.99 anywhere you go, you can get it super drug, you can get it look fantastic, all that kind of stuff. It's the shade Terracotta and it's an instant toning gloss. So it says here, it boosts colour and tone, enhances shine and smooths, rich conditioner with shea butter and argan oil and honestly i love that color it's so vibrant and juicy so on the other side of the box there's some very very bright pictures so i'm expecting great things it says gloss up with our salon inspired formula to keep your hair color fresh for longer okay uh, no damage uh, an no animal derived ingredients silicon free formula a rich conditioning product that adds tone and enhances shine. Anyone with natural, colour-treated hair that wants to boost colour and tone while enhancing shine. What will it do for my hair? It provides customised coloured results for share vibrant colours, depending on how long you leave it in. How do I use it? It says here, apply to clean, damp hair. Wear gloves. Avoid product staining. Squeeze generously. There's no gloves in here. That's concerning. Um, leave on for two minutes for a quick shine boost or up to 15 minutes for a complete refresh. Rinse and style as usual. Last up to 10 washes. Okay, so this is what it looks like in the packaging. It's just a tube. Apparently it's up to four applications. I can imagine all of this going on this. Now I do have kind of coppery hair as you can see, it's a little bit darker on the top than it is on the ends um, because it's faded. Um, I am just, I'm excited. I'm excited to see what this is going to turn out like. So what I think I'm going to do, I'm going to have a shower. I'm going to wash my hair like I would do normally, not put any conditioner in. And then we're going to try this. So, oh, it sounds like it's going to be messy, doesn't it? So I'm going to get some towels and stuff and uh, wash my hair and I'll be right back. Okay, so just had my shower. It's a very nice shower. Wash my hair. Um, I also have dug out some gloves. I found some gloves in a, another box dye that I have. So I'm just gonna like whack those on. It's got like a little notchy thing built into it. Can't do that with gloves on or fake nails. This is gonna be tricky. There you go. It's quite bright, doesn't it? Oh my gosh, that is so bright. Oh, this is gonna be really messy. Okay, so I'm back, I've popped it on. I've got to wait 15 minutes and then I can wash it off. You can wait less time if you want a less vibrant color. Um, this was so awkward to use. I'm guessing if you were in the shower, maybe it would be a little bit easier, but I have a white bathroom and trying to get this out of the tube and then again out the tube. I think the best solution for using this is use a bowl and a brush, you know, don't try and like wing it. It doesn't work. I got it all over me. So yeah, great fun, but it's on 15 minutes. I'll wash it off and then I'll be right back and we'll check out how bright it is. Hey guys, so I'm back, um, and yes, I've finished my hair. I've not finished my makeup, but I have finished my hair. Now, this, okay, where to begin? So it does make your hair look quite shiny. It doesn't affect the softness of your hair, so it doesn't like feel really soft and lovely. It smells gorgeous. This has got a nice, really, really nice smell to it, actually. Um, the only other thing I'd say about it is that if you don't do it like super evenly, it can look a bit patchy. So I know on my hair, like there are some bits where it just doesn't look like I've even colored it. It just looks exactly the same. And other bits, it looks like 
it's had some colour on it. So I think you just need to be really even with your application of this and maybe I rushed it a little bit, but take your time. The other thing I would say is that it was really cheap. So $5.99. Um, it definitely, definitely has not changed the colour of my roots. So on this little picture here, it tells you that if your hair is this colour, it will go to this colour. It will not. Um, it's definitely brought out the ready brassy tones in my hair, but my root colour is still my root colour. So yeah, I'm not convinced by this. If you're looking for an all over colour, you're probably better off going with something like glaze. That will 100% take your roots and they will change colour without having to use like a proper dye. Um, but this did not really do that for me. But, like I said, if you're looking to refresh your colour, so if you've got coppery, reddy, browny hair, you're looking to refresh it. Um, I got one application out of this box, but I have very thick, very thick hair, as you can see. And, um, yeah, it's quite long as well. So, depending on what your hair type is, Equally, you could just mix this in with like your conditioners and things like that and it will just give a boost and shine to your hair. So obviously it depends on how you want to use it, but for me, yeah, it's nice, but I don't know if I'll get it again. Maybe in a pinch. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you found it useful. Uh, let me know how you do your hair, what box dyes you use, if there's any out there that you want me to try, let me know in the comment section below. But for now guys, enjoy, take care, and I will see you all very soon. Bye.